Hey there everybody, it's me, Lisa the Love Coach, and today I am answering the question, are there any men out there who want to get married these days? Doesn't anybody want to get married anymore? This was a question that came to me because people have been seeing my evolution and my transformation and my entire journey for years and years and years, and they noticed that I recently got engaged to somebody that I just met not even six months ago, but when I knew, I knew, and when he knew, he knew, and off we are, building house, getting our life in order, finally at the second chapter of life, the second half of life. I am 50, he's 56, and I'm here to tell you that yes, there are men out there who wanna get married, and yes, you can get married at any age. When it happens, it is because you believe that it can. So this video is ideally for people out there who are over the age of 40, may have been divorced or maybe have struggled in their relationships and they have doubts and disbelief about marriage. Who wants to get married these days? 50% of marriages end in divorce, right? Well, 50% of marriages don't end in divorce, that means. So are you a glass half full thinker or are you a glass half empty thinker? And what kind of marriage do you want? What kind of vision do you have for being a couple together? What does that even mean? And are, your, in, are you interested in a God-based marriage? A marriage where you truly believe that God put both of you together to serve to a greater good, to become people who can contribute to society? So a lot of people out there are giving marriage a bad rap and the media and just all of this agenda that's been pushed to keep people very separate, to destroy the, the family, the nuclear family. And why? Because the state wants you isolated. When the state has you isolated, they have more control over you. When people start looking to their governments for solutions that only God can provide them through their own spirit coming through to create the solutions for themselves, that's when we run the risk of being run by our governments. And government wants nothing more than to destroy the nuclear family. Why? Because the nuclear family is our strength and connection to God, to our creator. When we connect with people and we get married to people and we decide to either have children or blend families or present ourselves in society declaring that this is my person and under God, we are not going to sever, break up, nothing. Nothing can separate us on a soul level Government doesn't like that, right? Especially governments that are more focused on control. Governments that are focused on freedom and liberties, they love marriage. They love people to be connected to God. They love their nation to be connected to God. They put God first. They speak openly about God. Whereas nations and governments that are more for control and want to give people false belief that they don't need God, they're saying that because they want you to need government. So this is a bigger, broader topic. If you are someone who deep inside of you feels that you want to be married, that you were married before and you married young and you made mistakes and now you find yourself 40, 50 years old, 60 years old, and you're like, you know, I know a lot now. I am very wise and I have seen things and I have grown and I want to experience marriage from this place in my life, from this place of wisdom in my life. Then honey, go for it. Because guess what? Your desire to marry was placed in you by your creator and why? because there is another person who wants to marry you. That which we are seeking is seeking us. So if you have a desire in your mind and in your heart to be married, it's because God has someone for you. God would never put a desire in us that God cannot fulfill. So I hope that that leaves you with a 
feeling of hope. Your person is out there. It doesn't matter if you're 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, 75, 85, doesn't matter. If you are on this planet and you have the desire to be married, it's because your wife or your husband awaits you. I am Lisa, the love coach. And if you want to find out what is blocking you from the love that you seek, feel free to click below, right below this video in the comment section, in the description section, and you will find a link leading you to the love block quiz, which gives you a full on assessment of what is blocking you from the love that you want and how to remove those love blocks so that you can attract the very person that is looking for you. Thanks so much and have a wonderful day. Bye.